I can't hold this vlog for so long so I thought that it's better to post it uh, just near to the marathon day. So right now I am in flight back to Bangalore so briefly share, so allow me to briefly share my experience for this. I get into Mumbai uh, just a day before which was uh, 14th of Jan. I did not do any extreme workout or any strenuous workout. I went into a, a gold gym nearby to the place where I was staying and I did all kind of workout I mean chest, biceps and uh, all that but with almost no weight because I just wanted my muscles to get used to and uh, I just wanted to activate those muscles for the next day's run and following to that I did a treadmill uh, run on at a lower speed of 7 to 8 kilometers per hour and following to that I did I definitely did extensive stretching I stretched especially my back uh, I did a lot of cat and camel and following to that I did uh, I did stretch my hamstrings I mean I spent good 20 minutes for that following to that I took a steam bath just to relax all my muscles and before sleeping this is my pre-marathon food it's burrito it has a lot of protein in it lot of seeds and some grains rice as well I went to bed around 8 but before that I uh, took multivitamins and uh, I massaged my legs pretty well with oil any oil will work if you have coconut oil or uh, um, there's a funny thing that I use you know double lal tail also for massage and then I showed up for the marathon and as you know my target this time was to finish this in 2 or 45 minutes but I ended up taking um, 2 or 50 minutes that's fine but I could finish this uh, without any injury and right now I don't have any kind of soreness into my legs so I can go to my work tomorrow without any strange walk so guys this vlog is just from uh, above the Arabian Sea because I can see it down so what was my learning is that, that there are a couple of peaks in Mumbai uh, to give you example it's sea link and also at the same time Patel Road is a very steep peak so if you are planning to be in Mumbai and run so I would strongly recommend that you prepare for those peaks because those peaks really at the time you know take a lot of energy out of you and really hit onto your speed so you practice and this is one area to uh, improve for me and right? so guys that's all for now and uh, we'll catch you up in next marathon i'm a marathon running enthusiast and uh, i'll be so happy if i get you any uh, valuable information so that's all for now and uh, Thank you so much for watching.